Hi. In this video, you will learn how to load, visualize, and work with multiple reference models. We work with multiple models the same way in all the earth moving solutions the dozer, grader, and excavator. In this example, we use the excavator. To select the reference models, we go to the main menu, then Projects, where we select a project to work on. We take Highway 66 for now. We open the Model Details page and press the Select Models menu to see which models are available. In the Model Selection page, we choose which models should be available for the run screen. Let's select these models. When selected, we press the tick mark to return to the previous page. Then, we press the Command Center menu to list the selected models. All models are set visible by default. This is shown by the yellow eye icon in front of the models. In the Command Center, we can define which models should be visible and used as reference. The eye button enables models as background images and or makes layers and specific elements visible in the model. In this example, we click the eye to hide the model, house plan, since we do not want to see it on the run screen right now. Note that we can only use models as reference when they are visible. With the Hide Inside selection icon, we can make models or specific layers and elements of models available as references. We can therefore run with multiple active references. So, for example, when the tool point has crossed over from Model A to Model B, the calculations will be based on Model B. We click the Height and Side selection icon to make the Road XML and the Sidewalk XML available as references. And press the tick mark icon to return to previous menu. Press X to apply changes and return to Run Screen. All models we toggled visible are now shown on the Run Screen. We can easily change the Command Center selection of models by pressing the Command Center icon from the Run Screen. It lists the previously selected models. Here we can make changes such as hiding some models or elements of models using the eye icon or use the height and sight selection icon to change which of these can be used as reference. Now we can use the tick mark to get back to the run screen where all the selected models and references are visible, ready to use. That's it. You have learned how to load, visualize and work with multiple reference models. Thanks for watching.